A little bit earlier, we talked about my laptop and my P2140 are consuming 300 milliamps of power in standby mode uh, while my car's up. So that's really bad. Uh, why? Because 300 milliamps will probably drain your battery in a few days if you leave your car off. So it depends on the size of your battery, but most regular size batteries, two or three days. And even if it doesn't um, drain it and kill it completely, that constant drain on your battery, um, the P2140 and laptop and standby mode draining a battery over one day and then you recharging it back again and then it's getting drained overnight and then you recharging it back again uh, throughout the day. It's just that uh, cycle of draining and charging and draining and charging is going to kill your battery a lot sooner than, than just a normal operation would. So what you actually want to do is avoid putting your system in standby mode, at least I do. So um, I want to find a way around it. So what I actually want to do is put my system in hibernate or standby mode. So hibernate and standby actually completely uh, shut the system down and draw very, very little power, at least 10 times less than uh, standby mode does. <clears throat> so the reason uh, um, for that is in standby mode, um, the P2140 has to feed the laptop a power on the primary rail uh, because your power in standby mode has to maintain power to your RAM and to your uh, USB circuit. So that's why uh, there's a lot of drain. In hibernate and complete shutdown mode, um, you don't need to maintain that power. Those circuits are off, so there's a lot less drain. So since I want to put my system in hibernate or standby, <coughs> or hibernate or shutdown, that means it's going to turn off all the circuits. Well, the little problem with that is now that all the circuits in the laptop, especially the USB, are off, now whenever the P2140 sends the ACPI um, signal over the USB line to the laptop, and the laptop is either in hibernate or shutdown, the USB circuit's off, so the laptop actually, it's kind of like, you know, shouting at a wall. You know, nobody's there to hear the signal that it's coming. So, what you want to do, there's a little uh, shortcut, or shortcut, there's a little trick um, around this that uh, some forum members have um, found. And actually, it didn't work out on my laptop just because I don't have the, um, the, the BIOS settings. So what you actually want to do is go into your BIOS, and you do that while your computer's booting. You want to press delete or F2, depends on your system. But once you're in the BIOS, you want to go into the power settings. Uh, this setting is always going to be the power settings. And as you can see, the only thing I have available is LCD power saving, which doesn't do me any good in this case. But as it happens, we do have an AOPEN system, which does have that setting, and if you go and if you go into the AOPEN BIOS, it's going to be under Power Management Setup. And as you can see, it's the AC Power Auto Recovery. So what that means is the system is going to start up whenever uh, it detects that's power to uh, the power plug. So anytime the P2140 activates the primary rail, my AOPEN is going to come on. So, uh, now that we have that to on on the AOPEN, we're going to restart it and show it in running mode, and then we're just going to dive on really quick. So we have the AOPEN running, and uh, the software is set up similarly to my laptop. So you have PS Humani, um, and it's set to hibernate or shutdown uh, and all that. So right now what I'm going to do is put it into hibernate really quick. So this is my car ignition switch, and I'm going to turn it off really quick and the P2140 it's going through its shutdown procedure now it's sending the ACPI signal and now it's going into hibernate so the AOPEN and the P2140 are in hibernate mode so looking at my amp meter um, I read 42 milliamps so that's a, almost 10 times less than standby mode so this is actually where I want it. So right now, if I left my car in a parking lot somewhere, I'd be probably okay for a week, maybe more. Um, 
so now that we've made the BIOS setting and the P2140 and uh, the open ion hibernate, I'm gonna turn my car on and see what happens. So 2140 boots, there's power on the primary rail, and the A open comes on. So Windows is resuming for hibernate, so we're good to go. Okay, so since we're talking about ACPI, and like some of you know, uh, Apple changed uh, the connector on the power button with their 2009 models. So we had to kind of <coughs> scramble around and uh, <coughs> make a new uh, Y cable for the Mac Minis. And this is a sneak preview of the new um, Mac Mini Y cable. And as you can see here, it's a tiny little PCB board with three connectors. So this is the second of two prototypes. The first one had a little accident the other day so this is the only remaining one and we're about to uh, test it over the next couple of days make sure it works and then send it off to production